Hello, everyone. I'm here with Elle, and she is a graduate of our Young in Life Coach training. And I wanted to interview Elle. Uh, thank you for uh, coming here and sharing your experience so other people that are considering the program know what it's like and um, and just get it, hear it from you instead of from us all the time. Yeah. So my first, sort of first question is, why did you join our Young in Life Coach training? Uh, there's obviously lots of coach trainings out there. What drew you to our program? Yeah, um, well, I had already trained as a coach on a program which was uh, great at building those beginner skills, but I was really craving something deeper. And uh, one of the areas that I am passionate about is helping people find their purpose. Ah. I I stumbled across you guys in doing some life purpose research And I had been uh, curious about exploring Jungian psychology too. And all of a sudden it felt like it it presented itself as the perfect opportunity to get that deep training and also learn how to use a Jungian approach in coaching, which I had not seen anywhere before. So, Were you familiar with Jung before you started? Were you familiar with this? I had some background in some therapy training before I I switched paths because coaching was a better fit for me. And so I had a little bit, so, but not, not um, like I say, not having seen it, how to do it in a coaching space. So I believe you're pioneers. Yeah, we are. Um, So tell me about like where you were before, like what what was your career path before you uh, decided to become a coach? Do you feel comfortable sharing? Yeah. yeah, I mean, originally I was a lawyer and I trained and specialized in being a media lawyer, so specifically mm. the music industry, and was a pretty unhappy lawyer from the beginning. <laughs> but it took me a while to leave because it's mm. one of those jobs that sounds quite cool and sexy and to be especially, you know, to be in the music business. Um, but my heart wasn't in it. So mm. um, really, it was my own personal journey that led me um, to uh, seek out personal growth and counseling and, and that path. And um, like I say, st- originally I thought I would train as a therapist, but there is something about coaching that is a much better fit um, of that high functioning individual that really wants to be a creator of their mm-hmm. life uh, rather than um, living in the past and, and resolving trauma. Okay. Yeah. That, that's so wonderful because that's what you're doing now for others is you're helping them mm-hmm. th- that are dissatisfied in their career, helping them find uh, what you found. So Absolutely. how was the training experience for you? I know it was all online because of uh, COVID and we didn't have a lot of in-person that we normally do during regular times. Uh, how was the training experience um, just being with the group and the, the colleagues in the program and what you learned? I loved it. I mean, it's funny you say about the in-person. I hadn't really noticed that we didn't even meet in person because the um, the coaching labs that you offer, so you have the small groups over Zoom, and I guess we're all getting more used to operating that way. Mm-hmm. Um, I really appreciated the flexibility, so the, the live input, but um, during the program, halfway through, I did a transatlantic move back to my home country. So the ability to be able to catch up on the recordings in my own time was super helpful. Um, and so, yeah, I felt it was really close knit. Um, you did a, an intensive, the Zoom intensive that you did, and that was also it was a great bonding experience for the group and a way of learning a lot. So, great. Yeah. And so, when you um, when you were in the program and learning the process, mm-hmm. uh, what was the, the the learning process like for you? Like, what did you feel like you learned anything new oh, yeah. <laughs> that you didn't know before? <laughs> it's like the understatement. <laughs> <laughs> it's almost like wow okay now we're talking that was that feeling of okay the it has such a clear methodology it was mm-hmm. for the first time um even though I've been coaching for three or four years for the first time I could really see oh this is how transformation happens and this is how I now believe as a coach I have you know the confidence to really guide people through that process and um so that was huge um, I remember you saying that, oh, I, I, now I see how everything fits together. It was like that. It's the, it's the foundation that we give and the philosophy yeah. of how Absolutely. a person changes. Yeah. And I, it's like no one had ever really shared that with me before or I hadn't mm. uncovered it in some other way. So that was huge. Yeah. And so what is the biggest lesson you learned or insight you learned 
uh, through the training that you'd like to share with others? Mm, that's a great question. Um, I think for me, it's that whatever presents itself, that's where we need to go to do the work. So um, even though it could be helpful to look at your personal history, whatever situation is actually showing up on a weekly basis, whether it's a trigger or something is going on, wherever it is, you don't need to go back over the past and resolve that. Um, you can work with what is here now, and that will be the space where you get to grow and, and create from that point onwards. Mm. 